How is it going, everyone? I'm Feather, and welcome back to more Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. In the previous episode, we did 4-8, the Castle Guards, or whatever it was called. So pretty much, we ended up fighting Wario and Waluigi again, and we even fought something called the Lava Queen as well, or whatever it was called. Something Queen. And that was an interesting fight. We did like four consecutive fights in a row, to be honest. And that was kind of annoying. No, three actually. It was three and then there was just the other fight. Either way, it was a good episode. I really hope you guys enjoyed that one. And now we're moving on. We're going to go clear whatever this puzzle is. And yeah. Let's see what that does. Okay, so we take this. We have the green areas. I'm not really sure what this puzzle is, but hopefully it doesn't take too long. Oh, wow, it's like right in front of me. Why did I not see that? I really don't know why I didn't see that. Okay, that opens up these. Okay, um... I guess we open this side as well, so we can go over here. Hit that giant switch. Yeah. And there we go. I could have done that in the previous episode. Come on. What am I doing? Oh, what's this thing? Well, that was flashy. Oh, this is the boss. Are we at the end of the game here? Is this the final fight? I'm not- like, hang on, hang on, before we jump into this, because I think this might be it. Um, let's go, we'll just start from Yoshi and go up. Yoshi has already good movement, uh... We can bump that up. A little extra damage to it. Ground pound's fine. Ah, oh, I should have gave him the dash damage. We can go, go with ground pound damage. Okay, for Rabbit Yoshi. Mm. Five ex or dashes, that's really good. Now let's give him some high ground damage, just so he's ready for it. Like, completely upgraded to 150. For Peach, let's give that extra dash damage. Um, sure. 150. Let's see. I've like never once upgraded that. You know what, let's give him more health. Rabbit Mario could use some more. And that's fine as is though. All right, for Luigi, there's really not much we can do. We could upgrade his damage, but I think that's it. Yeah, we'll do that. Rabbit Luigi. Do the same. Let's give him this. Okay. Yeah, you're not going to have all that much to upgrade. Let's just do with that. Same goes for Mario. Really not much I can upgrade. I can give him more dash damage, but I think that's really it. That is really it. Okay, so let's look at weapons for people who could get one. Well, obviously I need Mario as stepped up as I can. Um, 
I'll take that one. I want to use Yoshi. Yoshi could use an upgrade, probably. No, he doesn't have an upgrade, that's why. Because he's already upgraded. Rabbit Luigi probably could use something new. Okay. Well, that was just a bunch of mass upgrading. Let's go. This is gonna be fun. 4-9, Bowser's Castle. Hey, hey, you gotta help my papa. He could have licked that thing himself, but something happened to him. We're too late then. We should have re we should return to P Princess Peach's castle and marshal our forces. No, please. I'm sorry about before. I know it's all my fault. Mega Dragon Bowser. Well, that's quite the name. The ultimate boss. Okay. Well, that's just concerning. Alright. I'm scared. What do I even expect from this? Is this even the team I want to use? I don't think it is, to be honest. I'm kind of leaning toward your use. Oh, no, I have to go with this team. That could not be good. I meant to bring Yoshi. Oh, Rabbit Peach I was intending to bring, and Mario I have to bring, so... We can work with this. Actually, I should have been looking. What is Bowser all about? 1600 health. Burning damage. Okay. Can move pretty much all over the map, so it really doesn't matter where he's going. Magnet Dance. Villain Sight. Okay. No matter what, he's gonna come at me. Pretty much. Nice, hit those Valkyries out of here too. Take out that Valkyrie. And I'm just gonna hide out in this corner. Leave me alone, Bowser. Just leave me alone. I'm gonna hide in the corner. I'll stay in the corner if it keeps me alive. Alright. So Mario and Luigi are ready. Rabbit Peach, I'm just gonna pull up the shield just to be safe. I don't know exactly what Bowser's about to do, but I guarantee it's safe. Almost like I'm bombard him on this turn right here. Don't come near me, bro. <laughs> Just don't come near me. I can spam this all day. Oh no, he's still coming. Oh, 51. Are you kidding? 51. I was that close. Oh, ow. Okay, that's weaker than I expected. But there's still all the Valkyries lying around, and now Mario's in danger, so. Yeah. Alright, they're gonna give him a shield, but that's fine because I knocked his health down so much that he's pretty much dying. Except for that's not good. Alright. 
One more. Don't do another burn on me. Thank you. Ooh, but you're gonna do that. Okay, it's my turn. We can take him out, but let's heal quickly just to be safe, because I don't know. Because obviously there's more phases in this. If I straight out were to beat it just right here, wow, that's that'd be sad. This is a Mario job. Health. Where's he going, though? Ooh, he's just hurting everything. Mario didn't get hit because he's Mario, though. Mario's always ready to not get hit. Personally, I'm, I kind of want the Valkyries out of my way. It's out. <laughs> okay. Take out this guy. Alright. You're out of the way. So we just got two Valkyries lying around, and then we gotta deal with Bowser. As long as no more spawn in, I feel like I'm in a good spot right now. Maybe, I don't know. Okay, here comes Bowser, slowly intimidating me by flying around. Oh, he's spawning in more. Okay. Ooh, I still got hit. Dang. Oh, these burns are annoying. I'm gonna speed these up. Oh my, yep, buckler is great. This is my turn to be attacking Bowser, though. Bowser tends to go first, so if I do this, I can spam him. Uh, is that aiming for Bowser? Should be. No, this is gonna blow up the bomb, or, or not Valkyria. Uh, that dude. The bucklers are gonna be annoying, because they do a lot of damage. Actually, I can hit him. That guy's just hanging around. Oh, but I'm wasting those. That wasn't a good idea. Mm, shouldn't have done that. I forgot I had the Ouija set up there. Yeah, that wasn't my best idea. Unless it is, I don't know. I still got one though. Yeah, he's gonna move first. Oh, I shouldn't have done it like that. See, I could have hit him three times uh, as opposed to this one. I'm going after Mario. Oh, 
Oh, he doesn't really attack at all. He just does this. Granted, Luigi and... Why is Luigi right in the center? And why did Mario suffer? Mario didn't get hit, did he? I guess he did. Ooh, I'm losing Luigi! Because of that stupid burn. Of course, there's just a Valkyrie still running along. Just to make it annoying. Bowser starts moving, I can take him out still. Okay, he is gonna move. Nice. I can just spam shoot him here. Come on, Mario. Oh no, I don't kill him though. Dang. Don't hit me this time. Where is this fire going? Okay, yeah, hit him. Hit me. Great. It does seem to just hit Rat. No, there is something indicating that it's going after me. Huh, I didn't know so either. 7 Oh. Oh. Okay, no, I can heal. and take him out on this turn. So that works. Let's move first. Mario and Rabbit Peach at least have full health. It's a shame I don't have Luigi, because I really need him, but... Alas, it didn't play out that way for me. There we go, we take out Bowser. Alright. One more time, I assume. Ooh, at least he didn't hit me. Okay, got lucky on that one. Okay, what's he doing now? He looks it looks like he's charging something up. So I I'm doing zero damage. Oh, Mario's in trouble. He's gonna get that hit anyway. I gotta hit him. Oh, oh that hurts so bad. 100 is not hit, my friend. Yikes. Don't run right to the... Ah. Thanks, game. Great, I'm gonna lose Rabbit Peach. Well, not. Holy, the enemies! What the heck? How am I supposed to. What am I supposed to do if he's just got this shield up forever? I can't get out of this situation here. 
I'm screwed. Both my people are inked, so that's a problem. And, yeah. I don't even know what to do, so that's also a problem. I also don't get to shoot in this turn because of just being inked. Because, of course, of all things, I'm dealing with you. That's probably an automatic burn, and the fact that the game keeps forcing me into the center is screwing me over. It, it could be nicer if they would stop doing it like that on me. Hmm. I really don't know on this part. Grab a Pikachu just to survive by luck. That's it. Just pure luck. Only reason Rabbit Peach live. Nothing. What? I'm missing something here. I have to be. I can't break it. percent damage reduction, but he keeps doing it. Hmm. I can't compete with something that's never going away. Turn after turn, it's been just sitting there, not getting rid of that. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna lose. Already did. But, I saw that there. He hit a wall and it hurt him. Okay. Got it. I know what to do now. I'm gonna edit back to the third phase there, and we're gonna go from there. Because I think I know how to beat it now. Their safety. Now, I've already made those guys unable to actually do anything, so my best option right now is attack the one that can see it. Because those two can't actually fight back, so why worry about them? Same time I can't move, so just keep them away from me is fine. Just 
don't burn me. I can take him out, so I'm gonna take him out. Okay, well at least I wasted that. Now I'm free to move again, so that's always a nice plus. Up. We're gonna take a shot at Bowser. Oh, yeah. Also gonna do a quick upgrade on Yoshi's screen. Mm -hmm. At the very least, need to move a little bit so I don't have everyone too close. It's gonna force my power over apparently anyway, so. Oh. Feels like you shouldn't be able to reach me from there, but I guess you can. You know, I need to shoot at that guy. Oh, thanks, game, for readjusting my control there at the last second of my click. Knowing's <sighs> not worth it right now. Valkyries are gone. Next phase, I won't even have to deal with that. Let's 
been a lot more relaxed though once I got rid of the freaks. Phase one, okay. That better have worked out for me. No boundaries makes us a different scenario completely. Oh, I got it. Yeah. I think it's still my turn with nothing running around is kind of relaxing. Oh, I didn't just hurt my ear, did I? No, but I thought I did. The biggest logic, he's gonna move, and I have nothing to deal with right now. So, I'm gonna shoot at him now. Before the bucklers make their way in. I'm sorry, Bowser, you can't walk away this time. I'm getting my shots in. Oh, Mario couldn't reach, though. Oh, shoot, I wasted his. I would've been, like, nearly done this phase if I didn't waste that. I thought I would've reached. Typically, I just reach in general all the time with that. At least in this fight, it happened. Okay, let's deal with the bucklers. We can easily outmaneuver Bowser's fire, but I need the bucklers gone. Let's go for the one right in front of me here. Okay, that takes out that guy. Nice. One down. Three more bucklers to go, and then we can deal with Bowser again. And at the same time, I'll keep working on building up my stuff. Actually, before I do anything, I'll... Nah, he won't reach me. He shouldn't. Mario to be not alone over there. But I don't want to waste anything I don't need to. This one I don't think I need to. Ooh, that was really close to me. He's gonna hit me. Ooh. I've been inked, but I'll take ink over anything right now.
I'm gonna do a heal on this turn. I need it now. I'm just trying to clear people off first. Yoshi's been sitting at full health at this whole fight, so I'm impressed by that. Okay. If I'm lucky, Bowser will hit them, and then they won't be so close to me anymore. That's what I'm betting on right now. Okay, I hit one, and all I did was bring them closer, which isn't the best idea. I can take these hits. As long as they don't keep doing things like that. Yeah, shoot your friend though. Again, I can take the hit. But I'm gonna get that shield up just to be safe. Why am I putting Yoshi over here? I need to kind of be asking myself that one. Okay, well if I've been doing that, I kind of have to strike at Bowser now. Because I'm kind of stupid here. Okay, I'm being dumb. I kind of need to strike at Bowser now. I didn't do things correctly here. Phase, and we can go to the third one with everybody alive. That's a first. I haven't gotten that far. And I've been doing this for a while. Right, let's start with this thing. Crit right on him on the first turn here. Okay. And now I know how this works. I'm supposed to lead him into the metal blocks. They did it that way. But I'll take it because it keeps me alive. Okay, time to get behind things. My biggest scares I got is I got that block really, really bad. He's gonna get a kill, but I don't. Okay, I can take out that one. That's the only one that was scaring me, because he's so close to me that he will kill me. Or he'll kill Rabbit Peach, who I'm trying to keep alive right now. Save a single bar is right here. Okay, 
you know what, that's gonna hurt Bowser. So I'll take it. Dude, they just both hurt Bowser for me. Thank you. Alright, here come the Smashers. I gotta work on Bowser. And I can heal too. Excellent. Get me out of here. Running for my life. As much as I can, you know, run for my life right now. Gotta heal you quickly. You know, wow, Bowser is getting, what's he got, 900 left? Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna do that, we're gonna power up Mario. 273. We're gonna get a heal in. What does more? This does more, okay. We don't kill him on this turn, but we get pretty darn close on it. We get close to the point where on the next turn I could do it. I just gotta re hurry it one more time. Oh wait, whoa! That got really close, but at the same time, he went at me on the first turn. That works! Oh I got it. Okay. Unless it's a third fourth phase, but I have no clue. All I know is I got it on this one. Yeah, I just heard Bowser before. You, am I even getting hurt back here? I don't know. Oh, I was, yeah. Okay. Didn't feel like I was. Alright, Bowser. Here we go. Uh, I guess I owe you guys a debt of gratitude or whatever. I just hope this has taught you a lesson. Taught us all a lesson. Really, we ought to not to meddle with powerful forces beyond our understanding. Look, I can't promise I'll be good forever, but I'll try. You did kind of free my dad from a big, scary dragon thing. <sighs> guess I'll have to take my lumps when he wakes up. Unless you want to take the fall for me. I mean, he already hates Mario, so... A tempting offer. Alas, we must return to Princess Peach's castle to let everyone know that the threat to the Mushroom Kingdom has passed. Oh, yeah, well, until next time. Just tell me I'm done. How do they expect you to do that in seven turns? Nope. No way. Not happening. That in itself was difficult. Oh my god. Yeah, give me that good rating. I don't want it. I don't even want a perfect. <laughs> Team rank up. Your hero's health has increased. New weapons in stock. There are new weapons available for purchase at the Battle HQ. Lava pit challenges. Explore lava pit from scratch and find all the ten rabbit challengers. 
Complete challengers or challenges to gain more power orbs. Dig. You have dig with this contextual action. You can burrow holes in the ground at specific locations. No thank you. <laughs> Only if I have to keep playing, but I think this is the final boss. I'm pretty sure I was the final boss. So, yeah. Okay, that's it. That was a very difficult final boss. I'm going to talk about that final boss first. Wow, okay. Difficult. I, how long have I been recording? Uh, I mean, you only saw a few attempts probably based on what I decided to edit it as, but I've been going for about an hour and a half now. That battle was immensely hard. I could not figure out the right strategy to do it. I think I spent like half an hour trying to do it with Mario, Rabbit, Peach, and Luigi, and it wasn't working out, so I swapped out Luigi with Yoshi, and clearly it worked after another hour of trying, but it started to work out, and I was starting to get methods to do it. But dang, that was difficult. So I recommend if you're playing this game and you're not at that part yet, I re recommend you really pump up your people, because I am not as strong as I could be. I need to be a lot stronger if I was gonna handle that better. I just used a lot of brain power to try to eventually get through it. But it was painful. But other than that, let's talk Mario Rabbit's Kingdom Battle specifically. What do I think of this game? Um, that's a good question because I spent a while very uncertain about this game, but honestly in the end, it turned out amazing. It's a lot of fun. It's definitely a game that's worth getting on the Switch if you're just looking for something new to play, or if you're very into those tactical games, such as this, then this game is right up your alley, especially if it's based on Mario. For me specifically, a tactical game, I love those. A Mario game, I love those. A rabbit game, well, I'm not a big fan of rabbits, but you know what? This game has definitely kind of semi-changed my opinion of rabbits. They're not as bad as I always make them out to be, but... I don't know, it was a lot of fun. I really got a lot of laughs out of the rabbits, which is something I never thought would happen because I typically get annoyed with what they do. But I don't know, it was good, it was funny. And like, they didn't overdo anything. Like, I, that's what I, my biggest concern with this game was. I was always concerned they would overdo anything. Like, they would just make it not right. And sure, they had their moments that they kind of did, but I mean, it is Ubisoft, I'm not going to be too picky, they got creative freedom however they like, and I'm loving that these pictures are just Rabbit Peach's selfies throughout the game, that's... kind of captures the journey, doesn't it? But yeah, I really don't know what else what is... meh, I can't speak. I don't know what else to say. I consider this game a great game for the Switch, it's worth picking up, and that's it. I don't know what else. <laughs> I don't know. It's fun. It's a good game. It definitely provides a lot of challenge. I was flipping out at a lot of these last few episodes. Well, not the last few episodes. Like, maybe more at the start of World 4. I was getting so mad at the game and struggling so much. But I prevailed. So, that's all I could ask for. I prevailed. Oh, we're still in the World 1 pictures. How many pictures did you take, Rabbit Page? Like 20? Way more than 20? Probably way more. Aw, oh, how adorable. It's Rabbit Kong. I liked Rabbit Kong. Personally, I, though, out of all the four bosses, out of Rabbit Kong, the Icicle Golem, the Phantom, and Bowser, I personally think the Phantom was probably my favorite boss. Now, that's probably an overrated opinion there, just because... I think everyone prefers the Phantom just because it's a, a rabbit that's singing. It's just amazing. And it was amazing. I truly love that part. But, I don't know. Rabbit was, or the Phantom was just that boss that was very interesting. It was entertaining. It was fun. And I really enjoyed that one. Uh, as for worlds, I guess my favorite world, I would have to say. Um, 
You know, I think I was kind of a big fan of the Sherbet Desert. I really like the idea of that one where they mixed the ice world and the desert world together. That way, you know, they incorporated two kinds of worlds into one. I really liked the way they did that. And I just liked a lot of the levels in that one. No, don't get darker because I'm not playing. I am playing, game! <laughs> what even is that picture? I don't know. As for story, I guess, though, in this game, um... What could I comment on about the story? It was there, to an extent. I mean, sometimes it was just kind of random or thrown in, but... I don't know, like, the parts with Bowser Jr., I think, were the best parts of the story, which were the main points, but... So at least they got the main points down, but just the random parts here and there made it not as good there. I don't know, this isn't a game I really cared for the story. I was more playing this one for the gameplay, but at the same time, even still, who plays Mario games for the story, right? I don't. I typically don't, unless it's like an RPG Mario game, which this one is, but the story's not fully feels like it's all there. I don't know. Okay, um, let me comment on mid-bosses. Which was my favorite mid-boss? What do we have? We have Piranha, Parabit Plant, uh, the Desert Snow Guy, I don't remember what their names were, the, the two twin guys. There was that Calvera one. Oh, never again do I want to think about that Calvera, whatever his name is, Calavera, something. You know what you want to talk about, the one in this world right here. Never am I going to think about that boss again. I have nightmares of that boss because it was so difficult when I soloed that with Rapid Peach. That was absolutely awesome. Yeah, here he is, that stupid boss right there. But no, there's that one. Uh, the other bo mid bosses, there was Bowser Jr., there was Wario and Waluigi. I don't, I don't even know what to think about that. Um, there was that weird, like, lady thing. I don't remember what that was. Anyway, our favorite mid bosses, I would have to say my favorite was. Hmm. I don't know. They were all pretty there. To be honest, the Calavera one was probably one of the better ones because it was so difficult. And for me, like when I was doing it, it was such an intense battle, but at the same time, I absolutely hated it. <laughs> I truly hated that one. It was an interesting fight, but I don't know. I think it was because in that world, specifically World 3, I kept having to fight on that same map, and I absolutely sucked at fighting on that same map over and over. I just could not do it. What even is that picture? Is that like a f windmill fan thing? I don't know. Hmm. I've run out of stuff to comment on. I'm out. There's no more for me to say. Um. No. No more words. I'm good. Just enjoy the credits now. Personally, I should have just let you guys listen to the credits instead of me rambling, but I felt like rambling. So now I have to finish rambling. The Boom Boom Team. Thank you, Boom Boom Team. I don't know. The one thing actually I can sit, comment on with this game as well is to anyone, I guess, who bashes the game for just what it is, for the fact that it's rabbits or for the fact that it just it looks stupid, you gotta give it a shot, I guess. I mean, unless you truly aren't into this type of gameplay, I guess. But personally, if you are honestly skeptical about this game, you really should give it a shot because I guarantee it might be a really good game to you. Maybe. It's really hard to say. For me, I was skeptical for months on end with this game. Especially with all the rumors and leaks when it was coming out. It's just like, this is the stupidest thing ever. Why would they do this? And then it, they showed it, and it looked fun, and I'm glad I played it, honestly. I'm really glad I chose to actually pick this game up and play through it, and I really hope you guys have been enjoying watching me struggle, but at the same time triumph through every map. It was awesome and difficult at the same time, but it was a great, great journey through it. So, yeah, I couldn't be more happy with the way I played through the game and the way it played out. It's a lot of fun. 
the world is that? Is that like Bowser Jr.'s uh, toy, his favorite toy that we destroyed because we're awesome like that? Probably. The VP Editorial. Olivia Dava. Oh yeah, one other thing I want to comment on. I do not like how... Oh my gosh, stop it. I gotta like figure out how you can turn that off. <laughs> it's super annoying. No, one thing I want to comment on as well with this game. I did not like with party members how it took so long to get some of them. Like getting Yoshi and Rat... Or well, Rabbit Yoshi was fine. Actually, you know, it's just Yoshi. It's just Yoshi. I do not like that you get Yoshi five levels from the end of the game. Why? Like, you barely get to use Yoshi, and I mean, unless you're going backtracking to do everything, then maybe, but in the logical sense, that's so cheap that you don't get Yoshi till the end of the game. Granted, they give him to you, like, super OP, so that's a plus, but at the same time, it's like, come on. Be nicer than that. Alright, and after playing through the game as well, who was my favorite rabbit, and who's your favorite rabbit out of the main four? Who's your favorite? Because I personally think mine still remains Rabbit Luigi as my favorite. I honestly love Rabbit Luigi. Didn't use him as much as I wanted to, but I think he's still personally the best one. But I, I did grow to like pretty much all of them. Even Rabbit Yoshi, which I was like, man, that's going to be the one I absolutely despise. But no, honestly, Rabbit Yoshi wasn't as bad as I was expecting. I definitely like that he's like pent up anger built up shooting anything that's in his way. Like, I love that. Thank you, Rabbi Yoshi, for being my anger. Going toward the enemies. It's a good feeling. It was a really good feeling. <laughs> Especially when I was super frustrated, because there were some episodes where I know I was, like, super not pleased. So whatever happened to our biggest fan? What happened to that? And what happened to Beepo? Is Beepo going home? What happened to Spawny? Did Spawny get the mask off? They better answer this stuff. Wait, are you looping through again? I've seen that picture already. Yeah, it started looping through, I think. Am I in an endless loop? Or is it just a really long credits? I'm gonna go with the first one. It's an endless loop. It feels like an endless loop, unless I'm crazy. I think I'm crazy, but it feels like an endless loop. I don't want to be in an endless loop. I'm gonna keep my eye out for some of these names now. I'm looking at you, Olivia, but that's a different Olivia. The other one was like Daba or something. You think they'd have more pictures if they were gonna have the credits go for this long? I mean, I guess there's a lot of people who made the game, so that's good. They had a lot of effort put into it. I'm out of words. It's taking longer than I expected. I like the music, though. Oh yeah, I guess that's another thing I can mention. The music in the game. I like the music. It was fantastic. Really gave some reminiscence of older, like, rare games. And that was one of the things I liked about this game. Was how much it felt like I was playing a game made by, like, Rare or something. And, like, I love Rareware games. They're awesome. And it just kind of felt satisfying to play this one because it gave that vibe. Granted, it was with Rabbids and it was Ubisoft. But it gave that vibe of you're playing a rare game and like it's it's comedic, it's got amazing music, it's got great gameplay. Like that's what this game felt like, at least to me. I felt like I was playing um, that. Rabbit, not rabbits. It felt like I was playing a rareware game and it was awesome for that. I swear it's on a loop. I could be wrong though. Is it really this long of credits? I don't know anymore. I'm going crazy. Is this credits ever gonna end? I like credits, don't get me wrong, but when they're drawn on for so long, it's like, please, hurry.
transfer portal, I am going super crazy. I don't know what I'm saying, cause I've lost my mind. Now I have to go stop it. <laughs> Stupid sleep mode. You'll never win. I'm losing my mind, this credit is too long. Thank you, customer management, that's a big one. Oh no, it's small again. Okay, never mind, it's still going. I'm just trying to find a word that I recognize, because I know I know if it's a little bit. I can't believe my... Like, I, I've ran out of things to talk about with the game itself. Like, I, I express my opinion on the game. It's a good game, it's really fun, and it's worth playing, but... Now I just need the credits to end, although I don't remember that big chain of words, so that might be... something. Maybe. I don't know. Credits. Please. Okay, yeah, there's no way I did... Like, I... Yeah, it's still going. Like, I, I didn't see this giant chain of names. I don't recall that. That wasn't part of the credits. I swear, I keep seeing the name Joshua in there. I've seen it like 20 times. I don't know why I keep picking that one out. What is with the three Marias there? Maria A, Maria B, and Maria C. It's not their last names, but still. I get my point. Oh my goodness. That's a long list of names. What was this category for? Oh, there you go. Category ended. It was a big one. I don't know what else to say. I'm just gonna be quiet for now and let this end. Okay. You won't hear another peep out of me starting now.
Finally, that credits is done. <laughs> oh my god. That was that, 10 minute credits? Anyway, if ever a single appliance in all history has caused more trouble for more people, I'd like to hear about it. Wait a moment. History? I could use this time machine to help our past selves rescue Spawnee and save the Mushroom Kingdom more easily. Wait, what if I did that already? What if your biggest fan was me the whole time? <laughs> Nonsense. What kind of insecure egomaniac would lavish that much praise on themselves? So maybe I should forward those messages to my past self, just in case. Dearest Beepo, whose bravery, intelligence, and compassion, etc., etc., I'll just copy the rest. Uh, let's see who should I put as sender's name, so I don't confuse myself later, I mean, earlier. <laughs> I know, FB for future Beepo. Well then. Oh wait, I forgot the attachments. <laughs> On second thought, perhaps I should leave well enough alone. One never knows what int unintended consequences something like this could have. Oh well, what could possibly go wrong? I can think of 20 good reasons. Okay! Well, the task for the major of the game now. I'm done! I, that's it for this game. I'm not gonna do any more of the content on the game, at least not on video. I don't really have the time to. I gotta move on to new projects. This one's done. I really hope you guys enjoyed Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. It was a very great game. A lot of fun to play. I really hope you guys enjoyed this Let's Play for what it was. And yeah, other than that, thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe for more Nintendo content. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the episode. And definitely leave a comment down below what you thought of the series as a whole. Other than that, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Alright, see ya!